Hey guys, what's going on? It is me, Box 12 here with another Realm of the Mad God guide video. And this is going to be my first weapon comparison video. And I'm going to be talking about the top three daggers in Realm. The Dagger of Foul Malevolence, the Spirit Dagger, and the Dirk of Cronus. First, let's take a look at the stats. Foul gives you a damage range of 95 to 175. It's the most you can get with tiered daggers. Alright, that's pretty good. A range of 5.6 and 4% fame bonus. Pretty good. Now let's compare that to the Dirk of Cronus, which has a damage range of 105 to 210. So the range is all in all better. It's just better. The damage output of Cronus is better than Foul. That's just kind of set in stone. There is a chance that you could do worse with Cronus than with, you know, Foul. The chances are that you're almost always going to be doing more damage with the Cronus. But you're sacrificing 1.1 range. So you only have 4.5 range with Cronus, which is the same range as a sea sword. So you're basically reduced to a melee with leather armor. So a ninja. So the cost of having all this damage is reduced range. So you gotta get in there nice and deep, which is dangerous for somebody as squishy as yourself. You have to do this on somebody that you know you can tank or somebody that is stunned. All right, so the spirit dagger is a very interesting one. Its damage range is from a low 45 to a high 245. So these numbers are really extreme. None of these daggers have something as low as 45. 95 is the lowest. But also, none of the daggers have a damage output as high as 245. So the range really varies. You might be thinking to yourself, why use the Sea Dirk if Spirit Dagger has a higher damage output? 245 is higher than 210. Clearly, it must be better. That's not true. The range of Spirit Dagger is so extreme, you just have to get lucky. It's, it's pure luck if you do more damage than Dirk of Cronus. It's just a random number generation on whether or not you do more damage than Cronus. People prefer Cronus over Spirit Dagger because the damage range is very trustworthy. It's better than a Foul, and it's more trustworthy than a Spirit Dagger. Spirit Dagger could be as weak as an Obsidian Dagger. I mean, there's no telling what kind of damage you'll put out. It does have 5.2 range, so it is 0.7 more than the Cronus. It's almost as much as a Foul. But the damage is so wacky that you just, you know, you're taking a risk whenever you put that on. You don't know if you'll get the drop or not. There's a chance you could be doing a bunch of damage, and there's a chance you could not be. It's a very interesting item, actually. I'm, I'm glad that they have it in the game. It gives you some options, and it's just a nice item to have. I still... I'm... That was my first Spirit Dagger that I ever got, and my only one that I ever got as a drop, and I haven't used it, I haven't lost it, I want to keep it. It's a real treasure. Okay, so which one of these items is the best? If you had to play it safe, it really depends on your character. But I prefer Foul, among them all. Because the range is a nice 5.6, that's, you know, pretty far away, you don't have to go too deep on a character like the Trickster who's pretty squishy, it has a decent damage out output. You're doing more than a wand, that's for sure. Foul is all around a more balanced weapon, and that's why I use it. I mean, you want balance in this game. It has a nice range, it has a nice damage output, nice fame bonus. I mean, it's tier 12 for a reason. It's, a, it's good, alright? And it's the only one that you can buy, so if you want to make a dagger class with at least one top on it, put a foul on it. It's good. I think that's I think that's good, huh? I think I uh, think I made my point. Spirit Dagger is a random thing. Cedric is powerful, but it comes with a cost. And Foul is just all around a nice balanced weapon. So yeah, that's good. It's good. I think uh, yeah, yeah. Thanks for watching. And as always, don't forget to check out the next episode whenever I post it, which will probably be soon. Leave a comment for what you want me to compare next, because I have a long list of things that I actually am supposed to be comparing, um, but tell me anyway. Alright, thanks for watching. See ya! Sea Dirk is deadly, but dangerous. Deadly for the other people. Freak, I messed up.